Hey guys, Papa Faf here, and today we are going to be opening up the July BAM Horror Box. So, we have four themes, and uh, we're guaranteed one autograph in this box. So, the themes for this month are Saw, Pet Cemetery, Phantasm, and Poltergeist, I believe. So who knows what we're going to get. Um, I think it's like four to six items or whatever. Um, so we're going to just start pulling these out. What is on top? Okay, yes, yeah, so we got our, our BAM paper that no one cares about. Um, okay, we got our card in here. What's our card? Okay, that's pretty cool. So, this is a authentic BAM fan art card featuring a unique sketch from one of our featured artist alley artists. So, this is by Jason Miller. Uh, number 871 of 3000. So, that is pretty cool. Next item. Oh, yeah. Oh, we got to do our scratch off. We'll do that in a minute. Okay, so I feel the pin, and I feel something else. So let's take out the something else first. What is this? What is this? Why is it so greasy? Ugh. Okay, I don't know if you can... Yeah, you can't really see it, but... This is really greasy. Oh my god, look at that. Ew! Okay, we're gonna come back to that. Ew. Uh, I have a friend here just out of frame. Feel that. Hmm. That's gross. Uh, uh. Alright, next we have our pin. So what's our pin? Okay, so we got the TV from Poltergeist. This pin has a limited release of 250. Numbers are on the back of the pin. Okay. Not gonna lie, kind of a boring pin. Uh, nothing exciting about the Poltergeist TV. But, yeah. Alright, so I feel... I guess these last two are going to be the autograph and the artist print. I believe. Yeah, art print. Okay. Let's make sure... Is there anything else in here? Um... Featured Celebrity Monthly Giveaway. Okay, I didn't see anything that gives away what's in here. Let's go ahead and do the scratch off real quick. Uh, I truly don't think anyone wins on these. Uh, that's not even scratching off. Free Slab Comic. Uh, and... Yeah, every single one of these is completely different. What are you doing, Nico? My dog just showed up right down here. Alright, so, as expected, we didn't win anything. I don't think people really win on these. Alright, so we are going to start with uh, the art print. So, what did we get for the art print? Ooh. Oh, that is nice. That is very, very cool. Uh, 378 of 2500. I like that. Alright, so by process of elimination, the autograph is from Pet Cemetery. So who did we get 
I told you. I told you it was going to be Miko Hughes. That's cool. Very cool. I told you. I, I, I just I knew this is who this was going to be. All right. That is awesome. So we got Miko Hughes from Pet Cemetery. He played Gage. That evil child. That is an awesome autograph. I love that. Very, very cool. That will uh, that will get framed at some point. That's awesome. Okay, so let's pull out uh, these papers in here. And we will kind of go over what everything is. So we have our featured celebrity, Miko Hughes. Now, I haven't seen New Nightmare. I didn't know he was in that. And Mercury Rising. I have no clue what that is. Bam! Monthly giveaway. Uh, people don't win those. Let's be real here. Okay, so Celebrity Autograph. There were four possible... Aw, oh, man! Okay. So, for the autograph, there were four different ones that we could have possibly gotten. Uh, and those are the four. So, we got a pretty cool one there. Um, I think I would have rather had this one. But I'm still very happy with that. Now the collector's pin I am disappointed on because the pins that we could have possibly gotten were Heather, the clown doll, or the TV. And of course we got the TV, which is just boring. So here are the other ones. We could have gotten Heather, and we could have gotten, looks like two different well, ones of the clown. Uh, Artist Alley, of course, that is Billy, the Saw Puppet. Um, the prop, this greasy prop that is disgusting. Did anyone else have an unnecessary fear of the Sentinels from 1979's Phantasm? Enjoy this prop replica of one of the tall man's favorite weapons. It's so greasy. Like... Uh, kind of gross. And then the artist select card, which would have been this. Uh, so that is Harold from Scary Stories to Tell in the Dark. Uh, everyone will get a Harold card, and a lucky few will receive a hand drawn sketch card of another character. So, um,. I'm going to go ahead and say that probably doesn't happen either. Uh, just like people don't win these giveaways. Um, but that is cool. Uh, and actually, the last BAM Horror Box, the, um, the art card was of Gage. So That was a nice box. I'm happy with that. Uh, the next video coming up is going to be the Zobi Metal Box for August. Um, so that should be a lot of fun to open. Um, but yeah, stay tuned. Uh, like the video. Let me know what you thought of all of these horror goodies we got out of the BAM Horror Box. Um, subscribe if you haven't already, and thank you for watching. I will see you guys in the next video.